All right, if you're painting, you're gonna need a paint palette. You can use either the lids or the containers themselves. You're going to need a paper towel. I like to get it a little bit wet before you put it in the container. That way it stays nice and anchored. It also can help keep your paint wet while you're painting. Then you're going to squirt, how much paint, Miss Brown? A dime size. A dime size amount in here. <laughs> that way you're not using too much. If you need more, you can always pour more back in. And then you'll need a paintbrush. So you paint, 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 you get your paintbrush all messy. And let's say it's the end of class now. Now you need to clean all this up. This is really easy because you can just take the paper towel and throw it away in the trash can. This trash can, not this trash not can. Not the recycling bin. This one. Then you take your palette, return it where you got it. You're gonna return your paint into the storage closet, wherever that is. This is the important part. This cannot go in the container until we've cleaned it. Or you ugly things happen. Here, other do nots. Yeah. Do not <gasps> leave it in the sink. There is no magic fairy that is going to clean that for you. Don't do it. You also should not leave it in a water cup because this is what's going to happen. Oh, this is no. scary, class. This is scary. Boom, boom, boom! <laughs> <laughs> they die. The oh. paintbrushes die. There's no coming back from that. No. <laughs> So there's dried paint in these, and none of our friends can use these because they're dead. So we have to throw them away. Mm. And we don't have that kind of budget, kids. We got to mm -mm. save the paintbrush. Mm -mm. So what you need to do is turn the water on and actually use your fingers to rinse out all of the paint that's running clear. So that way there's no paint running through the water. When it runs clear, you are good to go. And you want to return it to the bin of paintbrushes with the hairs up. Do not put it down. If you store it down, then you get guys with bad hair days like this. <gasps> he was not very well cared for. His party bristles. in the front. <laughs> His bristles <laughs> might be clean, but he's been stored like this, and so now he's it's a broken paintbrush, Ooh. that's sad. So we wanna make sure that we always have the hair up. The last thing is when you're painting, depending on what kind of paint you need, you might be using a water cup. When you fill up the water cups, how how much do you tell them to fill up, Miss Brown? Um, less than halfway. Less than halfway, I, I no more than halfway, yeah. absolutely. Mm -hmm. You don't need any more water than this. Mm -hmm. um, if you fill it up all the way, I guarantee you will spill it before mm -hmm. you get back to your, mm -hmm. your desk. So when you're done with the water cup, it's also important that you dump that out in the sink and return it back by the sink where you got it. Did we cover it on this one? And make sure if you get paint in the sink, like that little bit of pink that's there, grab some water, grab even a paper towel or a sponge that we have by the sink and clean it up. Because otherwise, Mrs. Cantrell and I have to spend hours cleaning that up. And we don't love doing that. Look at how clean this is. Whoa. Nice. It should stay like that. Yeah. So help us keep everything nice and neat. Thank you. Thanks.